Hey sugars, it's Kenny. Thanks for visiting my channel today. I am in the household of JC on and my girls that year. So I just got this pop up because I guess JC on's realizing something about himself. He just got off of work and I think he got a promotion. So he's probably in a really good mood. So it says JC on has been feeling really cheerful lately. Things are going well and JC on doesn't have a care in the world. Embrace the change. Uh, it's like, it's not a bad trait to have, but you know what? Why not? Sure. Yeah. <laughs> So he's feeling good. He got promoted to pencil pusher. <laughs> JC has been promoted to pencil, pencil pusher. He will now make an additional eight simoleons per hour for a grand total of 23. Um, he also received a bonus for 300 simoleons. His next shift is Monday at 9 a.m. So that's great. He has five vacation, day, vacation days, which is nice. So if he needs a little break, he can take one. Let's check it. So he's tired as well. I wanted to get them out to the Spice Festival. So um, uh, we might do that. Look at his new little outfit. I'm definitely going to be changing it. I don't see him buying this. <laughs> um, but he does have a little more money now. He can spend that little bonus uh, uh yeah the little bonus he got from his job on and a work outfit but this is just not gonna be it that definitely those shoes definitely not those shoes because i have custom shoes that look way better than that <laughs> those aren't the worst shoes in the sims though let's be real so i uh i'm just focusing on him because i feel like he hasn't really been in the episodes <laughs> so far and i love him he's beautiful and he's a very handsome guy all right so he needs to be in the episodes as well but he's just been working for his family obviously zaire stays home and the baby of course stays home so we see them more but it is the weekend for him so hopefully we'll see him having a good time and enjoying life but while i was playing off camera I'm pretty sure it was off camera. <laughs> While I was playing off camera, Zaire got a little call and it says that her great, you know, you know that one. The great grand cousin twice removed, put back in, took back out, <laughs> take it back out, and put back. You know, that whole cousin's friends, nephews, you you know. And of course, I could have got the 2,500 simoleons, but since Zaire wants to get married anyway, I did the whole, uh, what's the one money money get it now want it now whatever that's the one we chose which means they have to get married i think in seven sim days and um i'm gonna make that happen for her but i do want them to go to the spice festival i did want to do some um family photos today we might have to push that to tomorrow which would be fine because I also have to get them some wedding photos because we're going to be having a wedding at the courthouse, okay? Now, I downloaded a courthouse off the gallery and that's where we're going to be going. But I didn't want to I didn't want to make it a machinima or something for a short uh video because I hate weddings in The Sims. I feel like I've probably said that every single time I've had a wedding. Um I had one of my sims get married in her backyard because i hate weddings in the sims i don't know i think you want it to be cute you want it to be nice but then it doesn't run smoothly so i don't even want to put the effort into making it look cute and nice i did like a scene for a wedding and then never had the wedding in a different save but anyway we're going to uh let jc on propose we won't force zaire to propose because i'm just not with it that's not the life i want my girl to live so he's just gonna be in the mood because he wants to marry her as well that's his woman they have their child together they're planning to have more children together and why not get married so like i said i think in the first episode i want this to be a chill lp i don't want to do too much planning oh, oh i got a little nervous don't do that to me um, I don't, I don't plan on doing too much planning beforehand. Oh, she's up. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Baby's up. Zaire has had, uh oh, light as a feather. 
Zaire is feeling a bit dizzy. Fatigue and dizziness seem to follow her around. Some supplements might help. She has a headache from anemia. Y'all, I'm I'm quick to get rid of a um illness, but it, she can't even take her medication. So I'm like, what is she supposed to do? What is she supposed to do? I had her drink some water. Ooh, what is he doing? Yeah, okay. So I want him to go plan his outfit so we can get them dressed. <laughs> Hey, look, cute mama. So I'm going to go into for, ja, I almost call him a whole different name. For Jason, I copied and pasted all his everyday outfits to his winter wear because most of them are like, you can wear them in, a, in the winter time. If you hear the airplane in the backyard. In the... All right. Let me get it together. If you hear the airplane in the background, I apologize. But, you know, I can't do much about it. But yeah, I copied and pasted his everyday outfits to his winter wear because I've made winter outfits or cold weather outfits in his everyday. So why not? He's probably going to wear this today. And Zaire, on the other hand, has no winter or cold weather outfits besides that one that we've seen a billion times. So I'm going to keep it. I mean, no, let's not. Let's not say we did. So let's make her a little outfit for today. Since he is wearing brown, maybe we'll have them match a little bit. Would I do this one? I can see her wearing that. I can see her wearing that. And I will just do probably with some leggings. I'll speed this up because uh, it takes me a minute to do anything. So yeah, I'll speed it up. Okay. What? What's, what's happening? Uh -huh. oh, somebody, oh, he's taking a picture. <laughs> oh, he's darn shoes. Anyway, he took a picture of her. I want him to put his outfit on. He just took a shower because, of course, he just got off of work. And he wants to get cleaned up. <gasps> She's pulling up. Wait a minute. <laughs> Yay. Stink a butt. <laughs> she pulled. Okay. She reached her milestone, pulled to stand with a mighty heave, right? Yeah. Nori has triumphantly taken a stand for the first time. The days of enmity have passed by so quickly and the era of toddlerhood is right on the horizon. <gasps> My baby. Alright, so we need to change her diaper. I'm gonna... Let's turn this off. She's awake now. Let's get the light on. I really wish there was a way to do the lights by age. Is that weird? But... I wish there was. I wish we could do that. So we got to get her cleaned up because she it did say she has a diaper rash. An itchy burning sensation is irritating Nori from underneath. So I don't like that for her because who wants to be uncomfortable? So Zaire, not Zaire, Jason, you could play your... Mm -mm. <laughs> You can play your game while Zaire gets ready. She already showered and everything this morning, but our baby is standing up. That is crazy. I'm so excited. And we're going to get Zaire dressed because it's getting kind of late. And we have to go to the Spice Festival just because I like the Spice Festival. I like that they can eat and all that. Let's take a, a selfie real quick real quick the selfie so as you can see her outfit is really basic i'm just gonna do this photo why not Open. 
so yeah her outfit's basic but i don't know if you notice with her a lot of her outfits are pretty chill not she likes patterns and she likes colors and nothing crazy so we're going to get him off the game and let's find that notification oh it's happening our up oh. <laughs> it's right outside what it's not oh man the spice festival is broken no no uh-oh this is no good well i guess we're not going to the spice festival we're gonna have a nice let's have them oh he's eating he said i'm hungry i was trying to get y'all to go eat but the spice festival is non-existent in this game i don't know what happened after he's done eating we're probably gonna just let them play the game together because the plan that i had oh my gosh what we will do because i feel like we're gonna do this every episode until my girl is knocked up but let's just go and take a test and just like last time if it says hold on if it if she gets that negative notification i mean buff because she is negative like the test is negative then we're going to just act like it wasn't ever there oh i'm nervous i'm nervous i'm nervous oh, oh my gosh girl she's not pregnant again what are they supposed to do and this time i'm pretty sure i took the protection off so that kind of sucks but fine we tried so tomorrow we're going to be getting married so since there is no cute little moment down here i still will have jc on and Zaire go down here because I wanted them I want him to propose at the Spice Festival. But uh, there is none. So let's get them out here. I want them to take a photo together out in the snow. We probably should have found a better spot to take a picture. Take a photo with Zaire, please. Probably should let her do it because I wouldn't mind getting her. You can see that is barely snow. Oh, give me a second. Yeah, my ga my game is having some issues, but uh, I want to take this picture. Am I crazy? Hold on. There we go. Let's take some good ones, y'all. All right, now we're doing all this bull crap. <laughs> um, so this sucks, but I'm going to go ahead and have my boy propose in the snow, even though they're acting like this is the most snow they've ever experienced and it's devastating. It's not that bad. Can't have the bowl the floating bowls with nothing in it come on jc let's do this babe y'all gonna hate me with all the pictures i i can't edit it all out <laughs> but i'll try you know Girl, give your me a... Oh, she's cheerful too? No, not both of you. Okay, let's do... Let's do a passionate makeup. See how this goes. Let me see. Let me see you. Oh, well, I guess it could have been nice the other way. <laughs> but that's okay. He can wrap his arms around her. <laughs> um, there are some sims I did add to the save, plus 
I did a couple makeovers, but oh my gosh, they're so loud in my ear. Hold on. Y'all are loud, but none of these Sims. Are, oh, I wanted JC on to meet this guy. He's I was doing like a challenge on Twitter. I haven't finished it. But I was making male Sims and he's the businessman. So just through this is not one of the outfits I did for him though. I'm like a hundred percent sure. She's so pretty. Hi, we wanna be your friend. Okay, um, guys, break up for a second. Not break up, but let's stop all the flirting, flirting, flirting for a second. And let's meet these people. Oh, what is she getting excited for? She's so cute. <laughs> They're still over there kissing on each other. Okay, dang. Let's be friends with people. What if they don't like each other? That'll suck. Okay, let's let's check out first impressions. <laughs> oh wait, wrong person. Wait. Yeah. They didn't get a first impression? That sucks. I might not have it in my game the right way, I won't even lie. So he met Did he introduce himself? Oh, they have amazing compatibility? Well, that's great. And he lives in their uh, apartment unit. I mean, building. Um, Friendly. It's Curious Inquiries is a, uh, is a mod that I downloaded. I think, ugh, I'm, I'm, I suck. It might be by Lumpino or by Deep Indigo. I think it's Lumpino though. I don't know. Okay, so it gives you a lot of information about them. You want to know more about me in general? All right. In terms of personality, I'd say I am outgoing, materialistic, ambitious. My likes are spirited sims, rocker fashion, fitness, blues music. I dislike the color white and I am right-handed. The crazy thing about it, I think all sims are right-handed. So that's kind of a cheat. But are we getting to know her? Is she becoming are we are we are we liking her? Let's ask her about her household because I know her house. <gasps> There's a sim I just made and she's over there all bright and colorful. Well not really colorful, but very bright. Hard to miss her. Are we gonna Get a notification. Okay, it says, I can tell you about my household. I'm a part of the voice ho household household. All right. I live with three other Sims. Their names are Alexander Voice, Julian Voice, and Megan Voice. Okay. Who is this girl? I made her, didn't I? Or I gave her a makeover. But let's do a friendly introdu inter introduction with her. And I'll just update her a little bit more at some point. Because... It seems like they're putting my sims from my tray files, but I don't have any sims in, tray, in my tray files, which is crazy. Oh, she's sad. Let's uh, let's stop the conversation with these girls. Hey, I want her to talk to you. It doesn't seem like I have first impressions in my game or it's outdated or something because she's not getting... Oh, she has amazing compatibility with her too. Her name is Shatoya. She's, oh yeah, she's part of the I can. Oh, that's I did put her in there. But this is just not one of her outfits. I'm very confused. I could have sworn I did all of her outfits. Yes. Yeah, so what? What the heck is that? Don't disrespect me. I didn't want all my Sims to look the same, but uh oh, uh oh, what? All right. Jason, you have this aura of magnetism that constantly draws me closer and closer to you. Zaire looks down at the ground and then back up at Jason. I hope you want me too. And he says he has three options. There's nothing I would love more than you right now. Unfortunately, you lack any sort of aura yourself or sorry I want you. Just not right now. 
I mean, he's never gonna turn her down. Let's be real. So hopefully, y'all not about to be outside. I'm nervous. Let's see how this goes. I'm nervous. Y'all naughty. Well, I'm gonna let them go where they're going, and we can look at some of the Sims. Not too close, cause they're they're not quiet. But she did she she's so sad. And this is actually where we're going to be having their wedding at the courthouse. And this, like I said, this is the courthouse I got off the gallery because that's where I wanted them to have their wedding. But I did not want to do it myself. So this Sam is just she. She doesn't dress how I personally would dress, but it's just so fun to make Sims that are different than my typical Sims and different than me. I really wish she wasn't sad because I feel like she would always be happy and joyful. She has stickers on her face. How are you going to be sad with all this color and ex oh, she's sad about this? That would suck because somebody really put their effort into that. And then decided to be, somebody else decided to be a jerk. Well, um, I don't know how long it's going to take them. So I will be back once they are uh, finished up. The baby just minding her business, moving around. So cute. She still doesn't have teeth. I got to change that. I feel like she would have something growing in. Maybe two. But I really like her room, you know. Nothing's going on in the other room. It's just, <laughs> I think it's really cute and soft for this little nugget. What is she about to do? Go play in it? Oh, she's just looking at it. She's like, what's that? I still didn't get a monitor anywhere. So we just have this camera. It's the, uh, oh, they're chatting. Let me make sure they're dressed, okay? <laughs> All right, so they're done. He has to tinkle, so let's get him to the bathroom. They're proposed. They're proposed. They're engaged. Oh, she's trying to crawl. Mama, go help you, boo boo. Um, activities. Practice crawling with Nori. Z Zaire. I mean, <laughs> I am terrible. I'm like a mom. Jason is going to actually shower once he's done with that and um brush his teeth it's really late brush your teeth you might as well go to bed my friend we have stuff to do in the morning Zaire is tired the baby is not the baby is hungry so mama I'm gonna have you let's try some more foods with her I think I have to get rid of this um She dislikes avocado. Let's try the papaya. I think I have to get rid of this high chair. It's, it's kind of glitchy. It's not working out too well. So, JC Young's gonna brush his teeth, go to bed. Zaire's about to feed her baby, get the baby to bed, and then head to bed herself. I really hope that little mama likes this food. Because she's she knows what she likes, but she knows what she. But I can't even say she knows what she likes. She doesn't know what she likes. She likes some things, and then other things. She's like, ah, I don't know. How exciting! Nori loved papaya paste. It's always nice to discover a new favorite taste and texture. At least she likes it. I'm happy for her. She has not been liking anything. But as you can see, it's a little messed up. I like this high chair. It's so realistic. <laughs> Messy mama. Jess. I keep wanting to say Jassier, which is my cousin's name. JC um, is in bed. So once you're done with that, I think I'm still going to have her feed her a little bit more. Because normally the babies don't get full off the baby food. Which in real life they don't either. Unless you feed them more than one, but let's, let's breastfeed her and then get her to bed. And then once she's done with that, she's going to tinkle, get in the shower, brush her teeth, and go to bed as well. 
Oops, wrong side. Oh, oh, oh. So y'all, once she is done, we're gonna get to bed and then I will chit chat with you guys when we get to, I was gonna say get to tomorrow, <laughs> when they wake up tomorrow. This girl cannot make anything. We really need to improve her cooking skill. So it's a little bit before 6 a.m. and she's making breakfast for her family because, well, obviously not for her family, for her man and herself because the baby can't eat this yet. Um, She did start a period, so no baby. <laughs> no baby yet. Um, JC on is still sleeping, but what I think I want him to do is just get up and eat. Oh, he's, he's really confident right now. Okay, boy. What is she listening to? All right. Wait, you like it too? Uh, he's... Uh, when you and your partner know each other's bodies as so well, you can be sure to walk out of each intimate inter what <laughs> intimate adventure with a great mood and a pep in your step. Okay, amen, amen. So let's put this away, Missy, and I am going to go i'm gonna take them to the bridal shop i'm not gonna record that because we're not really doing that but i'm gonna take them to the bridal shop and get some uh, get a little dress get a little suit and we're going to get married today so i'm gonna let them wait is she did she get enough sleep no we're gonna leave her alone so once she's done sleeping <laughs> we're gonna oh wow Hold on. I never even pay. Is, is this Max's match hair he has on him? I shouldn't even say Max's match. Is this the Max's? When did I say his hair could grow? Anyway, let me get it together. So it said lulled to sleep from being lull lulled to sleep by a lullaby. Nori was, okay, obviously she doesn't have her baby mobile but the lullabies are playing on the stereo i just didn't know it was really affecting her you know in game i thought i was just doing something i would do in real life but that's the oh okay so we have six more days until they can get married but of course we're doing that today but I want our baby to get enough sleep before we, you know, wake her up for sleep just so the parents can go get their outfits. But I'm about to get rid of this before I forget. Zaire, are you cleaning? That's good. I'm, oh, we have, she recorded a video so we could just go ahead and have her edit it at least before we get out of here jc on's cleaning he's cleaning the bathroom so that's cool but i'm gonna let him play the game and then once i get into cast i will record that picking out their outfits and then we'll be back yeah i was talking with my mic muted but anyway he's gonna bottle feed her i just had zaire post her video so that's good we're going to actually get her to brush her teeth this morning. Who do you guys think Zay... Not Zayir. Who do you guys think little... Oh, wait. Who do y'all think she looks like? Her papa or her mama? 
she's very skin tone similar to her dad obviously her mama's bright so the baby needs to use the bathroom i'm just gonna tell her to tinkle on herself right now so we can get that done where is it used diaper so yeah zaire has been making some pretty good money we're gonna get some pretty good money let's turn this off and we can turn the lights back on where's zaire I she was gonna be playing a uh, um, game. I mean, playing with a toy is really what I mean. I don't think they can use this. They haven't used it. They've been using the sink, which maybe they just like washing dishes by hand, but they have not used that yet. I could have put it somewhere else, but I mean, the location probably doesn't really matter. I'm going to. We're gonna head into gas, but we're gonna head to the. The bridal shop and get us some outfits for today and then we're probably gonna head to the courthouse right after oh, she's cleaning up i have is he what is he doing he's cradling his little baby girl that took us a little longer than i expected it to so i'm going we're back home but she's obviously in a good mood we're gonna get come on girl you want to wash this laundry wash this laundry let's add this to the laundry i don't know she's stuck but our neighbor came over said that we were loud the music is low and it's 12 p.m so <laughs> she's so cute she left her papa I wonder, is there anything that get fed, help, chomp? Oh, let's babble at him. I think my sims need to be reset because I did speed up the time. Hold on. I want him to help her crawl. It looks like Zaire is still a little stuck. Uh, bro, what are you doing? Oh, it's not this. It's this practice standing i want him to practice crawling but whatever the year all right she was she was broken uh-oh we're lost we're lost let's get the mail please and um it's getting a little later in the day so we gotta hurry up so we can get it you make my day so much better thanks for making me smile you guys are so speed wait what is this university university acceptance letter so she was accepted she can't click on it though okay don't they usually be able to click on it and be happy and stuff <laughs> um he needs to let's see if i can drag this into here can't i broke it Okay. They just don't like using it. So it says absent accessibility. There is no sign language interpreter on today's program. Zaire feels upset about that and also upset that she's upset about that. Even though it's not exactly a small thing, but still. <laughs> yeah, I can I can see her acting like that. Like why Am I watching this? And if somebody else wanted to watch this, they can't even read anything. They have to read lips. 
Ooh, y'all, I have muscle spasms in my shoulders and I'm having one right now. Anyway, let's not talk about me. Okay, let's put some walls down. I'm getting stressed. So our baby is growing and glowing, but it is time for mommy and daddy to get out of the house and go have their little courthouse wedding on this snowy day. Can barely see out the window. Can't see out the window. So, um, does Zaire need to change her, you know, she got six hours. So, all right, like I said, we're going to head out and get them married. Is something's broken? Am I seeing things? Girl, put, put the baby toy down. That is for the baby. All right, JC, on put her down. Let's travel with our fiance. So we are here at the courthouse and um i'm gonna show you that but i'm gonna sh i'm gonna show you guys the inside because it's really cool and then uh we'll head to the ceremony spot i'm gonna let them get dressed while we take our tour and then we're gonna have their little ceremony they don't have any people you know doing anything for them during this wedding it's super fast it's super just i want to marry you let's get married and get some money you know Right, so you come through the front door and it's like the receptionist spot um oh, ignore this the ceiling soup it it gives courthouse i won't even lie uh, so then we can go upstairs behind the receptionist desk but if you go through here it is one of the offices not sure to who i don't know who's in the courthouse don't ask me these questions and through this door there is the spot where you can have your ceremony but you don't have to go through the office to get there you can go through this door because you come right back to the front oh it's another desk on the other side uh yeah this room is the court room where they handle some serious business probably could use the tool mod to get that you know on there a little nicer but that was really cool like how they did this i like it so let's get a little short and then we go back out the doors and if we go upstairs onto the second floor there are different rooms that i have not been into but uh i'm guessing there oh this is a bathroom okay good to know and we're gonna do this fast because we don't need any of these other rooms right now oh she oh you can have your reception in here okay cool i guess i don't know if they really have those in real courthouses so there's another bathroom this room is just a just a room <laughs> just a closet okay well maybe you want to you know do some things like i said they're supposed to be getting dressed they don't listen so let me help them out so we got our girl a little white dress yes she wore white and her shoes are white as well okay are you hating <laughs> so we did a little bit of makeup on her took her glasses off she's looking cute and then jaceon has this uh, some dress pants, dress shoes, and this suit jacket with the white, I was about to say a white tee, a white buttoned up underneath. I could not figure out like how he would dress up for a random wedding. I don't have like a theme or anything. So this is how they're looking. I don't know if they can walk down the aisle. I, yeah. So let me see what we can do. Something always wants to mess, make me mad. I don't know why she went outside. I don't know what's going on. Like, why? What are you doing? <sighs> now, now she has to run inside with her heels on because nobody told you to come outside. <sighs> These Sims, they like to make you mad, don't they? Broke in the day.
just just everything trying to make me mad <laughs> she's shivering like they don't have the heat on in here you get in calls <sighs> y'all don't want me to be happy you can have your married sims move in together by using the split merge button in the household management section and i mean don't you think they're living in the same household already so we did get some simoleons. You, you've satisfied the conditions to get the inheritance money. You'll get a deposit soon. Congratulations. They got about 14K. So. New house coming soon. <laughs> New house coming soon. She's cold. I'm going to let them get back into their winter wear and head home to their baby. Because this, I told you, I hate weddings in this freaking game. And it wasn't even a... Oh, let me plan it out wedding and it still was giving me issues we are back home and my pause and start won't work i thought she was about to pull up she might or she just oh or she's just talking to the couch i'm not sure what is he watching is he watching sports <laughs> of course Oh, what's wrong? What's wrong, mama? Zaire, um, I don't know what she's crying for. Papa, yeah, get your baby. Oh, we do, girl. Banjo, Banjo, put you out of glass, Oh, she's stressing. Um, so just to get it over with, what are you doing in here, girl? We're gonna have her enroll in what what? She got her her acceptance letter. You feeding her? <laughs> he said my baby is hungry. What is he feeding her though? I don't know. She's unsure about crust. She's unsure about everything. Is she still hungry? That. Come give her something to eat. Let's give her some peanut butter puffs. I know I would love that. What? <laughs> okay. I love peanut butter. This is loud, year. The application is still going through the system. Check back soon. Oh, they got their marriage certificate. And what is this? This is the acceptance letter. Oh no. Uh, Nori life <laughs> peanut butter puffs. A successful taste testing. Of course, because they're delicious. The only time you wouldn't like peanut butter puffs is if you're allergic. Okay, slow down, y'all. You little messy girl. Alright, so. I'm a little irritated with the whole application because it says that she was accepted on the letter but then she can't actually enroll so this just delaying us a bit it's already winter time so she's already behind technically oh my gosh what's wrong she's sleepy that uh, yeah get your baby <laughs> Pick her up, Papa. Yeah, put her to sleep. That year, uh, I wish you were pregnant, but we're not even gonna waste our time with that. We're not gonna waste our time. I'm so uh, no. I did not take any pictures of them. Um, with the photo mod by Ravishin. Even though I should have, but what I'll probably do is just have them take some. Dad, pick her up. Let's ignore her crying. Stop it. Let's pick her up. And we're going to put her in her crib because she's sleepy. Thank you. She just crying, crying, and crying instead of taking her butt to bed. So, Zaire is just cleaning. She's tired. It's only five o'clock, but go take a nap. <laughs> go take a nap. 
good job, Dad. So he can enjoy his day. I'm gonna let him tinkle because he has to use the bathroom. Is the laundry washed? It's clean and damp. Let's move it to the dryer. And then I think that's it for this episode. I wanted to get the married. They did. They got some money. It sucks that they're still not pregnant, but you know, we don't need to rush it. I think the next episode I'm going to bring. <gasps> we only got two days. I think we're going to be celebrating our baby's birthday in the next episode. I really, unlike weddings, I do like birthday parties. So I'll probably be planning something out for her. I have an idea of what I want to do. But we'll probably be planning her a birthday party very soon. Where is she at? Let me turn on the, her lullabies. But like I said, in the next episode, we'll probably be celebrating our little mama's birthday and i'm a little bit a lot of bit excited even though i forgot to give her teeth let's just say that her teeth are taking it their time growing in oh she's so precious but um i know that we haven't had a birthday party for her but in my mind once she started pulling up and everything she's about one already i know People say once they become toddlers, they're one, but I still feel like that is too big. The toddlers are still too big for a one-year-old. I think infants, once they start walking, they can still, they'll, well, I consider them one-year-olds. So we didn't have a party for her, but she did already age up to one. So in this next episode, when we have her birthday, she'll be two. That's how we'll be looking at it. I know it might not make sense to everybody, but she'll be two. That'll be the age that we'll focus on for her toddler first toddler year <laughs> thank you so much for visiting my channel today if you enjoyed your stay please give me a like and chat with me in the comments make sure you've subscribed especially if you made it this far and i will chat with you in my next video bye